Hi everyone, I'm Amir, I'm Dory, and, and we're, we're Backpack, Backpack Journalists. Journalists. Today, I'm, we're here to tell you about bus safety on and off. We interviewed Mike Hamu at the Durham Bus Lot. Roll the clip! Is the toll roll project in the bus? There's actually equipment that's installed on the bus. And one of the great things about Zonar is uh, that you'll like is it tracks on-time performance. It tells me when a bus gets to school and when it leaves school, so it makes sure people like yourself get to school on time. Another great thing about it is it lets us know that uh, our drivers check their buses for sleeping children. So after they drop you off at school, they got to walk the bus and they got to scan little zones on their bus and they got to look underneath seats, look behind seats to make sure they don't leave people like you on a bus. How exactly does the zone Great question. So the drivers have to use a wand and they scan all the uh, Zonar tags that we just talked about. They scan all those tags and they write in their wand all the notes about it. So if there's a defect that they find and they say this tire doesn't look right, this tire needs to be replaced, they note it. And then what that does is it sends all that information to my maintenance folks and we have to look at it, we fix it, and we put it in a system and it tells the driver that it's been fixed. And also, uh, it sends me alerts that lets me know that they check to make sure you're off the bus. It's shiny. That is shiny. And the reason why it's shiny is it's brand new. We just ordered 14 new propane buses for Charleston County School District. And these are going to start on some of our magnet routes out of North Charleston area. And this big old green sticker, what that means is it's propane, so it's cleaner for the environment. Uh, so this bus has AC, which is going to be welcomed, right, because it's hot, right? So we got 14 brand new buses with AC on it. So Durham bus safety tip number one. Stay when you're on the bus and stay in your seat. Tip number two, keep the noise level down or in other words, talk softly. Tip number three, keep your head, hands, and feet inside the bus. Tip number four, don't throw anything in the bus or out the windows and definitely no eating or drinking on the bus. Keep the bus clean. Durham safety tips number six says when you are riding, waiting for the bus or you have just stepped off the bus, the first tip is to stay out of the danger zone. That's anywhere within 10 feet of a bus. Don't ever try to get anything you left on the bus after you already have gotten off. Durham School Services will do its best to ensure personal property is returned. Never, ever, ever try to pick up anything dropped underneath the bus. Whatever it is, the item can be replaced. Kids can't. Always follow the driver's directions about how to cross the street. Be alert. Look both ways. Be courteous and cooperative with the driver and that's our safety tip thank, thank you for watching our backpack journalist adventures today at durham bus lot stay tuned stay tuned for more backpack journalist adventures